guys, it's Jason here, and I'm gonna do a reaction. Or, well, I'm tasting hot pops. I already started doing this, but it wasn't that hot, like, at first. But now it's starting to get pretty hot, so, um... Mmm. Mmm. Ah, that's starting to get pretty hot. never buy one of these again I mean for hot pops and the way the package looks I'm a little disappointed in how hot it is I mean it's still hot but it's not as hot as I was expecting like I was expecting for it to be really hot and then me to give like this big reaction because it was so hot but it really isn't as bad as I thought it would be no it still tastes nasty because I don't really like the taste of chili and hot isn't I don't really like spicy things at all mm. Ugh. hot that's, that's pretty hot so anyways we'll just wind down the video there and um if you guys got any more ideas for things that you want me to try, uh, just let me know and maybe I'll try them. Uh, if you could keep it to like under a dollar, like something I could pick up for the 99 cent store, or, you know, less for less than a dollar, maybe, probably even maybe do like two or three dollars, but you know, something not that expensive. I know, uh, I'll probably do it. Um, this was only 33 cents, and so. No, not that expensive. Ooh, it's starting to get pretty hot. But, um, yeah. Let's see how hot we can make it. Mm. Like, mm. you can tell, you can see there's like the dark part of the chili part, the other part's the uh, watermelon part. You really gotta get the like the chili part to get the hotness. But anyways, like I was saying, let me know if you have any ideas for things for me to try out. Um. Uh. So, yeah. Pretty hot. Not as hot as I thought it was gonna be. Don't like the taste of it. I wouldn't recommend this. But if you know you like chili and you like fruit and you like them together, then you'll probably like this. But that is all for this video. I'll see you guys later. Bye.